million great stories to tell, but the more I learned about the BP oil spill, the pressure between big business and working man was, I thought, quite amazing. And then the survival tale, that all just kind of added up to a great story for me. Uh, well, I played Mike Williams, that guy over there. He was, uh, you know, one of the more knowledgeable guys on the rig. He was the last guy to survive. He's an amazing guy. He did some pretty extraordinary things. He doesn't like being called a hero, but uh, he certainly is in my eyes. I'm simply here to speak for my 11 brothers who can't be here to speak. And so I, I use that power and that emotion to try to translate to you guys um, and to Pete in the creation of this film to tell the story that hadn't been told to this point. You want to get it right. And so for us, there was so much attention to detail and, and understanding who the people are of that rig because it's a very specific job, it's a very heroic job, and it's a very normal job for them. This is a powerful film that is going to shed some light on some things that people didn't know. That in and of itself can apply pressure to the people who make those decisions to maybe change the culture of the offshore oil and gas industry. Companies like that have to be able to, even when money's on the line, they have to have cooler heads that can sit back and say, wait a minute, slow down. Let's not charge into a really bad situation. Well, I think obviously if they'd have taken a little bit more time, spent a little bit more money, uh, the disaster could have been prevented, and hopefully we'll do that in the future. It's really about those men, and it's such a compelling story. It was so visceral, it was so emotional, it was so about things that none of us really knew had happened that day.